with an ethereal glow. They had to navigate through a maze of twisting paths, each one seemingly leading them deeper into the heart of the enchanted woods. As they ventured further into the forest, they encountered peculiar creatures and enchantments that tested their resolve. They faced bewitching illusions that threatened to lure them off course, and mischievous fi creatures that played tricks on them. May's water powers were used to create paths through tangled vines, Ravi's earth powers were used to dispel curses, and Kai's fire powers were used to light the way through the dark forest. They also encountered a powerful guardian, a majestic creature with antlers made of crystal that guarded the heart of the forest. The guardian challenged them, testing their worthiness to proceed. They had to demonstrate their unity as a team, combining their elemental powers and working together in perfect harmony to overcome the Guardian's trials. As they passed the Guardian's test, they were granted access to the heart of the enchanted forest, where they found a mystical pool of water. The pool shimmered with an otherworldly light, and they knew that it held the key to unlocking Kai's true potential. Kai approached the pool, and as he gazed into its depths, he saw a reflection of himself, but with a powerful aura of fire surrounding him. He understood that the pool held the essence of the fire mark, the final piece of the prophecy. He reached out and touched the water, and as he did, he felt a surge of power coursing through him. He realized that he had unlocked the true potential of all the elemental marks, and that he was now ready to face the ultimate challenge. As Kai stepped back from the pool, he looked at his team, Mei and Ravi, with gratitude and determination. They knew that their journey was far from over, and that the fate of the world still hung in the balance. With renewed purpose and unwavering resolve, they prepared themselves for the final showdown against the forces of darkness, knowing that they were now more powerful than ever before. As they left the enchanted forest, the world seemed to shift around them, and the skies grew darker. They knew that the final battle was imminent, and that they would have to draw upon all their skills, powers, and the strength of their bond as a team to prevail. With their hearts filled with courage, they set off towards their final destination, ready to face their destiny and save the world from the impending darkness. Chapter 7. The Final Showdown. Kai, Mei, and Ravi continued their journey, now empowered with Kai's newfound abilities. They followed the final clues from the prophecy, which led them to the heart of the Dark Citadel, a foreboding fortress that loomed ominously on a desolate mountain peak. As they approached the Dark Citadel, they encountered formidable obstacles and traps set by the dark forces. Kai's fire powers were crucial in melting through barriers of ice, while Mei's water powers were used to counteract scorching flames that threatened to engulf them. Ravi's earth powers were used to create shields to protect them from falling debris and magical attacks. Finally, they reached the entrance of the Dark Citadel, guarded by a legion of dark minions. With their combined elemental powers, they fought their way through the hordes of enemies, displaying unmatched skill and teamwork. The battles were intense, but they pushed forward with unwavering determination, knowing that they were the world's last hope. As they made their way deeper into the dark citadel, the darkness grew more suffocating, and the air crackled with malevolent energy. They faced treacherous traps and illusions that tested their resolve, but they pressed on, following the guidance of the prophecy. At last, they reached the inner sanctum of the dark citadel, where they confronted the dark sorcerer who sought to unleash chaos upon the world. The sorcerer was immensely powerful, wielding dark magic that threatened to overwhelm them. Mei, Ravi, and Kai fought valiantly, using their elemental powers in perfect synchronization, but the sorcerer proved to be a formidable foe. In the midst of the battle, Kai realized that he needed to tap into his inner strength and fully embrace his destiny. He drew upon the power of all the elemental marks within him, unleashing a blazing inferno of fire that engulfed the sorcerer. With a mighty roar, Kai vanquished the dark sorcerer, dispersing the darkness that had shrouded the world. As the darkness dissipated, the citadel crumbled around them, and they knew that they had to make a hasty escape. They raced through the collapsing fortress, navigating through its treacherous corridors and avoiding falling debris. Mei used her water powers to create a protective bubble around them, shielding them from harm. They emerged from the crumbling citadel just in time, as the fortress collapsed into ruins behind them. They looked back at the now destroyed citadel, knowing that their mission was finally complete. The world was saved, and Kai had fulfilled his prophecy. As they made their way back to the village, they were hailed as heroes. The people rejoiced, grateful for their bravery and sacrifices. Kai, Mei, 
and Ravi were celebrated as the Miracle Kids, a legendary trio who had saved the world from darkness. With their mission accomplished, Kai knew that he could now return to his village and live a peaceful life. He bid farewell to his newfound friends, May and Ravi, knowing that their bond would always remain strong. He left with a heart filled with gratitude, knowing that he had unlocked his true potential and fulfilled his destiny. And so, the tale of the Miracle Kid came to a close, but the legend of his epic quest and the power of unity and courage lived on, inspiring future generations to never lose hope and always believe in the power of miracles. Final Epilogue Years passed, and Kai had returned to his village, where he was welcomed as a hero. The mark on his skin had faded, but the memories of his adventure remained etched in his heart. He had grown into a respected member of his community, known for his wisdom, kindness, and unwavering courage. Kai often thought about his friends, Mei and Ravi, and wondered how they were doing. He had heard tales of their own adventures and achievements, and he knew that they had gone on to make a positive impact in the world. He cherished the memories of their time together, and the bond they had formed remained unbreakable. With the darkness vanquished, the world had changed for the better. The lands that were once plagued by darkness had blossomed with life, and the people had found renewed hope and optimism. The power of unity and courage, demonstrated by Kai, Mei, and Ravi, had inspired many to come together and strive for a brighter future. Kai eventually found love and started a family, passing down the tale of his adventures to his children and grandchildren. He continued to use his abilities to help those in need and became a mentor to young adventurers who sought guidance. He lived a fulfilling life, knowing that he had played a pivotal role in saving the world. As Kai grew old, he found solace in watching the next generation of adventurers embark on their own quests, carrying forward the legacy of the Miracle Kid. His story became a legendary tale, passed down through generations, inspiring countless others to believe in themselves and the power of miracles. And so, the tale of the Miracle Kid lived on, a testament to the enduring spirit of adventure, courage, and the unbreakable bonds of friendship. The world remained forever grateful to Kai, Mei, and Ravi for their selflessness and bravery, and their names became synonymous with hope and heroism. The mark on Kai's skin may have faded, but his legacy as the Miracle Kid would forever shine bright in the hearts of those who heard his tale. Thank you for joining us at Short Story Central your go-to destination for captivating short fiction. If you're craving more tales that transport you to new worlds, make sure to subscribe to our channel for regular updates on the best short stories from around the globe. Don't miss out on your next literary adventure. Hit that subscribe button now and stay tuned for more exciting stories coming your way only at Short Story Central.